friends welcome back to a simply simple scent i have a um, scents and warmers that i have been enjoying video to film for you guys today and then before anything else i had gotten today is the release of starbucks um holiday drink so i got a holiday drink for hubby and i and it's so festive with their cups you know their cups for the holidays is so popular of like what type of designs that they're coming out with so I got this green one, which I think is really, really festive. I did not know this, but the first day that it comes out, which today, November 6th, and I don't know if it's every year, November 6th, but they give you a free reusable um, hot cup, okay? So the guy goes, oh, do you want this? And I was ready to pay like, I think two or three dollars because you can purchase these for that. He goes, oh no, you get this for free. I'm like, what? <laughs> I have been ordering Starbucks for so many years and today is the first day I learned that. All right. Let's get back to business. Oh my gosh. Okay, November. Today's November 6th. I can't believe we're in November. <laughs> I can't believe we're in November. It just seems like we were like decorating for the fall and all of a sudden Halloween was here and such. So I did change a couple of my warmers. Um scents a few days ago i took out my halloween warmer except for jack <laughs> jack i have him year round so he was upstairs into my office i think i will keep him year, um, year round over here into my studio for now but um i like having jack around <laughs> it makes me more festive not just for halloween but for any um holiday that we are having for the moment but um, just to show you guys really quick what I do when I do change out my scents, I just get this uh, cotton ball from the Dollar Tree and then I pop like three of them in there. I leave it there. I let it soak in for about two minutes or so. Um, and then I just, you kind of take them out and then put in your new cube, okay? So I do that around the house. Also, since he does sell the cotton balls, they're fairly thick. And then I, when I do change out the scents onto my warmers, I can get about six uh, warmers into using that uh, thick cotton pad. I think it's $6 for a pack of maybe 50, but it's nice and thick and then it really soaks in the, the hot wax really well. So like I said, I can clean out about six uh, warmers within one of those um, cotton balls. So look for those onto the, um, the Scentsy page of um, cleaning your warmers. Okay. Anywho, <laughs> I have been slowly decorating into Christmas because I only have a limited fall warmer. And as I mentioned in my other two videos, I like to, um, because taking out my warmers is a bit of a hassle for me because there's so many, I like to enjoy them about two months. So I started taking out my Halloween warmers back in September, first week of September. I showed you guys that when I first opened up this channel. I'll show you a couple of my fall, but I am starting to put in the Christmas warmers in there because I have so much Christmas warmers. Christmas um, Scentsy warmers is one of my favorite. Christmas and fall. Um, very, very festive. It gets you into the, the holiday spirit. That's how I feel because I do use my warmers as part of my um, decor. All right, first off, I have been enjoying my Scentsy Go. This one I just took out of the car because I got my nails done. And this one has uh, tiramisu, so I just, I don't know, I, I turned it on, but I don't know if it still has power. Yep, it's still got juice. As soon as you turn it on, you can smell whatever scent is in here. So in here I have pumpkin, I believe it's pumpkin tiramisu. It smells so good. It's one of my new favorite uh, fall scents. It came out for the the Harvest Collection, and I believe we still have it available, but you have to buy it into a three pack. If you only want the pumpkin tiramisu, the um, the pod is no longer available. The the ter um, pumpkin tiramisu pod is no longer available, but you're able to put the pumpkin tiramisu bar, Scentsy bar, into your Scentsy club, uh, even though it uh, it's only being sold into a three pack. Um, harvest collection you're able to put just that one pumpkin tiramisu into your sense club if you're interested in that now pumpkin tiramisu is a very sweet pumpkin scent like i said it's one of my my new favorite this one and then i would say um cinnamon pumpkin swirl uh pumpkin roll those um those really nice pumpkin scents but very sweet and 
one of my favorites. So with the Scentsy Go, okay, you can put in one or two pod. And actually, you know what? If you do not have the Scentsy Go, because these are $50, and if you don't want to spend $50 on a Scentsy Go, of course, you can do a party and get it half off. Um, but also, they have the mini fan diffuser. I believe this is $16. Now, I purchased this a few months ago. I have not even used, I have not even used it because I'm always going to my uh, Scentsy Go. I think I bought this just for one of my children. But I, because I only have one, and I don't believe I wanted to share with them. But this is the mini fan diffuser in a blush color. So much more affordable than this one if you want uh, to be able to try using it. And then you can put one pod in here. But this one you can put two or one. But then you put the pod in there and then you can put this into your car because I think the car would work really well because it's a small confined space compared to like an open space like uh, my studio here and then it comes with its own cord and plug and then you can plug this into your car your laptop but you just put that in there okay it okay all right right okay you just put that in there and then you get this USB plug it into your wall socket or your um, car or laptop such and then you have the smell um, around you this is good for small confined spaces I would think um, because it's just a smaller version of this one okay got that one in pumpkin thermos too oh my goodness that is so good Alright, so been enjoying that and then also I have been enjoying a room spray. This one is the jeweled pomegranate. So I've been spraying this onto like the, the trash area, um, around <laughs> the shoes. I'm looking outside. I tend to spray this more onto the shoes. Be careful when you spray this though because it does have oils in there. I did spray this before like onto a wall and then you can see the... Um, um, like the the little circular dots onto a, a wall so just be careful of where you spray it okay so this one I've, um, I have been enjoying jeweled pomegranate um, same as the the room spray this is the scent of the month for the month of November I did a video in here of my warmer of the month and scent of the month currently um, this is 10% off which is uh, for the room spray any scents of the the jeweled pomegranate Scentsy bar Scentsy circle and then 10% off for the warmer of the month which is the country Christmas which um, last time I checked it was still um, available okay and then the jeweled pomegranate if you guys want to know what that smelled like it's shimmering pomegranate sparkles with sugared mandarin and a twinkle of cinnamon I I like that addition of cinnamon in there come come november i'm not really into that cinnamon strong spices scent because i have been warming it into my home since about september so november right about now time frame is when i'm getting into like the christmas scent of the fur the um the needles the cranberry the the like the sparkling <laughs> i call it the sparkling scents of the holidays and i believe that jeweled uh, pomegranate is just gets me into that festive feeling for the holidays including thanksgiving thanksgiving and then the the christmas holidays but still not an abundance of the cloves and the nutmeg and and all that those to me are just the spices that is too overpowering sometimes and i don't mind going into fall september and october but come november i i cannot handle too much of that okay so really been enjoying that this is the first bar and i only have like about three cubes left Okay. All right. Speaking of all that um, spiciness, uh, I have an empty honey pear cider. My last video of scents and warmers that I have been enjoying, I told you guys I've been enjoying the honey pear cider. Went through that whole bar within maybe about two and a half, three weeks. And I turned on one of the warmers <laughs> before I filmed this that I didn't turn it on for a few days. And I'm done. <laughs> as much as I love honey pear cider, cider mill, um, like I said, all those strong clove, nutmeg, all those spices, 
come November during this time, I, I can't. I can't do it anymore because I'm like so ready to move forward. And I, even though over here in the Pacific Northwest, it's all about fall. I mean, it's gorgeous, beautiful. I love it. I love the fall season totally done with this um honey pear cider it was just uh, my nose was not agreeing with me but honey pear cider if you guys are interested in that like i said <laughs> i could be the only one but honey pear cider let me see what it is i cannot find it for the life of me into this catalog but it is onto the website so honey pear um cider is fresh juicy pear and a sweet honey together with subtle hints of ginger root cinnamon and clove Okay. it's really nice I mean I really love the scent um, I've been warming it obviously but I, I think I'm just ready uh, for more refreshing um, holiday scent okay all right and speaking of refreshing holiday scent I have been enjoying silver bells and okay I have a lot of bricks to show you guys silver bells and the new marshmallow mint cocoa oh my gosh Oh my gosh okay first off uh silver belts i've been warming this for a few days now it's one of my go-to oh my gosh towards more christmas holiday scent and then even after the holidays even after christmas into new year's and then valentine's day i feel like this is like a perfect snow snowy weather um scent um i love it okay so snowy snowy weather um silver bells I did find that one in here. Silver Bells is mint candy canes dance over warm and welcoming winter pear, all enveloped in a velvety blanket of caramel and vanilla sugar. It's so funny because um, I've had this for a few years. I'm almost done with this brick. I don't smell caramel in here. Um, it's just a nice, refreshing holiday scent. I do smell that mint candy cane and then the winter pear. Um, I don't know about the vanilla sugar but definitely not the caramel okay it's just perfect it's a perfect balance of of everything for the holidays it's so refreshing it's just like you know when you go out to you know go out on a date uh first date or what have you but uh you you and then you enjoy that you know that meal together you want to put on a freshly mint gum or tic tac or whatever and then so it'll get you nice smelling refresh for that kiss that's what i i feel that silver bells is it just makes it nice and refreshing into your home to your don't eat it <laughs> but okay you got that one and then our new brick so let me just get in here really quick i'm on to my website let's go look at the brick um, my last video i showed you guys the uh, the brick collection that we have we are currently having our holiday bricks which is so popular I'm all about bricks you guys know that but it's one for 24 or two for 40 you can mix and match and what I did was I got two of this and then I didn't get the pretty and plaid that was the only one that I did not get but they have crimson berry which is really good as well but it has that cinnamon apple cinnamon to it that I'm going to love come september <laughs> september october next year and i'll probably be able to enjoy it you know for a couple times this year but like i said i'm just so over this um spices but that did really smell good and then they also have they have the let's see they have this one marshmallow mint uh cocoa which is this one reminds me of junior mint at the movie theater junior mint and the york uh, peppermint candy so since it says this is cozy up with a mug of hot uh, chocolate as airy marshmallow and peppermint float above a rich layer of creamy cocoa this smells amazing i had gotten two i placed another order was it yesterday yesterday for that deck the halls which is still available and then the two mini warmer i added two more of this because my friends okay look okay it took me this one was about a last year or maybe two years ago and then this is just within a few days okay i broke out the the cube so just to let you know if you've never had scentsy bricks do not put one scentsy brick into your um into any of the scentsy dishes it's going to overflow it's it's too much 
um because i think four is like max so that's equivalent to probably about four cubes what i do is i break it and then i cut it into four some people cut it into halves and that's enough for them but I, you know me i savor i savor all of the sensi cubes so i cut it in half and as you notice so there was three so that was four eight twelve so there was twelve little pieces and they're pretty good size this smells amazing, amazing. So when I first uh, warmed it, I had put it into my bedroom. And I'm telling you, hubby was like, what is that? Are you baking something? I'm like, no, I didn't say anything yet. And then Danny, like a few minutes later, Danny from her bedroom is at the very end of the hallway. So my bedroom door was open. She goes, mom, what are you baking? What are you baking? Is there brownies? There brownies? Where's the brownies, mom? I went downstairs. There's no brownies. Where's the brownies? Smells so good in here. You're hiding the brownies. No. I'm like, it's my sensi. It's like, oh, I want it. So I ended up giving it to um, the kids. Kids' bedrooms and then hallway. And then I had it downstairs as well. Very, 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 very nice. I love it. Love it. Love it. It's going to be one of my favorite. This one and then also the, um, the silver bells. Oh my gosh. So I got four bricks. That's going to last me a lifetime. All right, now speaking of that cocoa scent, um, I told you guys that hug in a mug, my kids, I had this out here, and my kids took it out again because they love hug in a mug, okay? Hug in a mug is just like this one and then this one put together. Oh, wait. So I feel like this one, the marshmallow mint cocoa is this one and like hug in a mug kind of put together. Okay, you got that the the cocoa the marshmallow and then you're adding in the minty freshness to that oh my gosh you guys grab this it's so good the other one is pumpkin tiramisu i think i had one left i only got one bar um but i did add it onto my sensi club because when i purchased this it came into that three pack of the harvest collection um but then i added it onto my sensi club so i'll be getting it until i remove it from my sensi club so cannot wait to get more so down to, um empty i don't have any more I don't mind for the fall I don't mind warming more of this so instead of the spices I think I'm gonna break out my my pumpkin roll uh, my farmstead pumpkin and then uh, pumpkin cinnamon swirl um, but no more of the the spices okay so I also was warming this into my bedroom this is the caramel sugar cookie okay I got this one because I was getting ready for the other brick that also came out, which was, it was another sweetness. It had toffee, but you can smell the butterscotch onto that one, okay? That one was salted caramel toffee. That one has a hint of butterscotch in it, and you can, when I was sniffing it, you can, you can smell that butterscotch. So to me, that was really nice and sweet, so I cannot wait to warm that one as well. Again, pretty in plaid. And then the other one was Snow Kiss Cranberry uh, Scentsy Brick. That was really, so there was five Scentsy Bricks. Okay. And then I was also, I think this is, um, out of all my bricks, this is the one that I'm almost, almost done. And this is Blueberry Cheesecake. So Blueberry Cheesecake, I had gotten this into my, um, now it's called the Scentsy Club. Prior to it being called the Scentsy Club, it used to be, I think, VIP. Uh, I don't know if it's VIP club or just VIP. To, um, onto the Sensi Club, there are about 10, I want to say 10 uh, bricks that you can order. Um, blueberry Cheesecake is one of them. It's also available into the small bar within the catalog. But Blueberry Cheesecake is one of my favorite. Oh my gosh. I love it. I think I'm going to warm this in my bedroom tonight. It just smells amazing. It smells amazing, okay? I just, I love it. I love it. I love it. Okay, so blueberry cheesecake, for those of you that want to try, it is, okay, um, thick, rich New York cheesecake with a light graham cracker crust and delicious blueberries. Ah, amazing. The other one, this one I don't have um, a description. And then... The hug in a mug was uh, curl up with chocolate, hazelnut, and cookie dough. Okay, that was hug in a mug. Curl up with chocolate, hazelnut, and cookie dough. And then I have apple butter frosting into, <laughs> into a brick. Okay, so I was already a consultant when I had gotten this from another consultant because she was the only one um, that I can get a hold of 
that had the bricks. So as you can tell, this is like so many years old. <laughs> Look at the coloration of that um, of that clamshell. Okay, but even though I've had it for so many years, I have had this for gosh, I want to say four years now. It was like my first year of being a Sensi consultant. I purchased it from one of my um, local area consultant, and it still smells the same way as my bar because sometimes I get the bar as well. And because I don't want to use up the brick, I don't know. It's so weird, right? But this is the only brick I have. Apple butter frosting smells amazing as well. You know what? Apple butter frosting really smells good when we had it into the um, like the car bar. So I don't know if the car bar is still available because I prefer uh, Sensigo. The only time I purchase car bars is when it's on sale. But apple butter frosting is a heartwarming medley of cinnamon spice apples and decadent vanilla buttercream. Okay, and that's it. I think I've shown you guys everything. All right. Okay, so that's my camera shutting me off, telling me I talk too much. Um, let me go ahead and show you guys the warmers um, that I have been enjoying into, um, into my home. And then as always, I thank you guys for visiting me over here at a Simply Simple Scent. Thank you guys. This is a new channel for me. I've only had this for about, a, about two weeks now. I appreciate all the support that you guys give me over here. Uh, follow me on Instagram, a Simple Simple Scent. I put in there like information of new release, uh, warmers that I'm enjoying as well, and then scents that I'm enjoying, and then also my life channel, a Simply Simple Life. I'll be I'll be back there soon <laughs> I'll be back there soon but I think I'm gonna keep that channel for like my you know my purses uh, my planting my gardening and then my recipes kind of life all right friends let's go ahead and uh, and see my my warmers into my home as always mahalo all right so I'm using my phone which is better quality to show you guys the um, the silhouette of this uh, leaves. This is the fall foliage warmer. It is into my downstairs hallway bathroom. And let's go turn that off so you guys can see. Look how beautiful this warmer is. This is still available. It's currently for $20. It's gorgeous. Let's go ahead and start off over here. This is right behind me. So you guys are always seeing this. Um, I'm actually going to show you the cabinet also, the shelf, uh, right behind me. One of these days I'm going to switch around. But I love my personal tree. I chose all the, like, the princess, and except for, like, my most favorite, Jack, and then Mickey and Minnie, and then also, of course, Island. I got to get uh, Lilo and Stitch um, ornament. I was looking for Lilo, but I don't think they made Lilo. All right, so over here we have Jack, and like I said, I keep him year-round. And then this is Starry Christmas. This uh, first came out into our holiday collection. It is currently sold out. This went um, fast, like really fast. Within, I think, the first few days that it was released. It's absolutely gorgeous. It's made out of tin, and then it has these star shapes all around. And then that's where the dish is. Okay. Beautiful. One of my favorite new warmers. Okay. Alright, so I'm not quite ready, but these are like the holiday warmers that I'm going to be displaying into my home. I currently have it into this shelf right here. Um, this is the 10% off warmer for the month of November. This is Christmas, I believe it's Country Christmas is what it's called. Okay, let me go ahead and show you the other warmers I'm using. Alright, so this is my coffee bar. I think hubby put that too high but i'll have him bring it down a bit um in my coffee bar i bought this uh table from home goods unfortunately though it does not fit this current um keurig but i will be getting a smaller version so it'll be okay for now i have two warmers in here this one uh pumpkin spice everything nice this one has the honey pear cider um, so when I first turned it on, I'm like, okay, too much, too much, um, spices for me. Okay. But I really like this warmer. Okay. All right. And then over here, I forgot what this, uh, warmer is called, but I'll put it onto the description or 
um, type it down. But this one is three tiered. It all separates. This was warmer of the month, the month of November. I want to say maybe three or four years ago. Again, honey pear ciders on this one. And then sometimes if I want a really um, strong performance of whatever scent I have in here, I just have it displayed and then have the top to the side like that. Okay. But it, it is very pretty if you put the lid. Okay. Both of these warmers are very beautiful. This one was part of the holiday collection, um, the, not the holiday, the harvest collection again this year, but it sold out. It was available last year. All right, and then on this corner, um, during Halloween, if you guys remember, it was almost exactly the same. I just um, moved some pumpkins around, and then also I added the, the gnome here. But this one had the raven. And then this one had the etch core for Halloween. So I took out the Raven. I have this Give Thanks warmer. So this one, I'm sorry, it's a wrap. So this is the Give Thanks wrap. And the wrap is, it's just open face like that. And then um, you can use the etch core. This is the Travertine. And then there was another one that was a marble, um, marble design, but it was the same shape that you can use the wraps for. Okay, really like that one. Give thanks, I love the, the color, the color of this pumpkin. Okay, very pretty, very festive for fall. Then of course I got the Vino warmer in there, same as last time. All right, then over here I have the wildlife warmer that I have onto my bay windows and then I Put my house plants over here so it'll get more light and then i had moved my aloe vera i believe it's aloe warmer or aloe vera warmer this one and then i put it into a pot and that's what it looks like i just turned it back on and then there's the dish All right. so it goes like up to here and then i use the pot to kind of lift it up just like i use these um like target i get them usually at the tar um, target dollar spot for like three or five dollars to prop them up okay all right friends as always thank you guys for visiting a simply simple scent and as always mahalo